What's happening, Kevin? This is your boy, C.B. Hunts. And what you have before you is the McFarlane Toys, My Hero Academia's, Miro Togeda, a.k.a. La Million. Man, I've been waiting for this bad boy for the longest, but I did have him and Deborah on, on a... On a the order from the McFarlane uh, toy store online. Yeah. Stuff was popping up everywhere else, but them having their own store, they weren't shipping anything out. So I had to, had to cancel to get my money back. And I had to order from Amazon, where Amazon had his own, had his own pre order again. And it came out early. So I don't know why you keep putting stuff up. On your page, and, you, and, you, and, and it's not sh sh shipping anything out. So, yeah. But well, finally, I do have it. This is the one line that he gets like someone, someone right on. Hey, line. Even though lately, uh, before I told him, getting a whole lot of issues with they with with their ankles on their feet and. Ab crunches and everything else, but at least I can say they're the only toy line that's been making a whole lot of figures for a whole lot of companies, especially my hero. They have got out a, a whole lot of people out already when other companies keep doing the same ones over and over again and then just stop. Yeah, at least McFarlane Toys do like have that uh, there. So, hopefully, this line will still will be still be going, cause I do want the whole one A and the League of Villains. So, hopefully, we'll like get that soon. But for now, we seeing the box right here looking quite nice. You see, same box that they always have. They got the uh, image of the figure in front, got the name out here. Let me see everything is packaged. This part bleeds to the side. Got name again. His name there. Name to the figure here. This side all is to show the actual toy line, the, the, the show, and and the app, or whatever it is, the animation. But on the back, as you see, it's a little bit different. It's a different figure. One thing I'm not really liking lately from McFarlane Toys because lately. First couple of waves, they will have the full, full actual toy, the toy, two head sculpts, hands on and stuff. And I was buying doubles. You, ain't lying. you know what I'm saying? I was buying doubles. So, because I wanted like two, two versions showing off each part of the things. But now he sees he can make a little like, like, like extra money. But I see the can't because I can't find the other version of this one. This one here is the uh. Out of addition of this here, with him with his different face hair scope, we about no mask, bad face, and we, 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 we have you say the word. Out of addition, sometimes it's hard to find, especially on certain toy lines. Not every toy line of this platinum edition, you can, you can hardly find something you can, you can uh, uh, easily find, but the, but the, uh, my heart. My Hero Academia, yeah, it's hard. Look at a draw on Amazon, and, and, and you already know, eBay. So hopefully I can find the other version of this one. I do want the him with, with that head scope, and the same thing with um, Endeavor. On the back of the box, his foot is like, his like, uh, Flames are a different color than it actually is on the actual figures. So hopefully that's probably like a different one. I don't, I don't like know if it's like lighting effects of the picture. So I don't know. But once we get back, we will have this bad boy at the box. And we'll see what to do with a Togeda. And now we got this bad boy at the box. Man. Gotta say, like I said first, uh, figure looks nice. Got a lot of issues in certain certain uh, aspects, but trust me, we'll talk about it so we 
and so we try to get the hands on the figure first. We're gonna show what everything it comes with. And you know, it comes with the plain black stand with the logo. Plain Jane. Next up, they come with um, Mario is a is 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 like a pair of hands, and this is his fist. As you see here, we always scream the word every time he uses his fist when he punches. We always scream the word power, and like yeah, he got some nice stuff. But I just wish he would have came with an extra head instead of well his. I can say that his sculpt. <laughs> I'll say that. <laughs> but now we will talk about the main man himself. Love me. Like I said, this figure here is the way he looks is off the chain. Like the type of the, the paint, the sculpt of the figure is crazy. I got, like how it goes with. 3D effect on his uh, um, million on his chest, designs of his shoulder pads, like more of a more 3D and he painted on, more of the stripes as well, the color pans is like blue is just popping, got the white is gleaming, you can see with the, with the uh, turquoise belt, uh, like the boots he got, clean. They ain't got no small feet, so they kind of be able to kind of hold them up. I like the cape, has like it's still kind of like like guys got a flow, but it's like it has that type of flow where he if you're doing like a bad as walk in, that's the type of flow it has. I kind of like that. They do the design, the gloves. I love that dark, a dark. Mm -hmm. Ma, we want the gloves, that and the face scope. Real look like legit. Now this one, out of all of them, he look just like the cartoon. That's how he looks. But I'm old school. Uh, can't think of the name of the cartoon. Probably put a picture up right here, where his face you see him in the cartoon and everything else. But the one thing they didn't do on this figure and the other head sculpt, I noticed. M Miro has blue eyes, not black. This would have been like on point if he had the blue eyes. I'ma see if I no I can't, but because like the black eye is it kind of throws me off a little bit. But I know he supposed to have his eyes his eyes blue, so look, look at that. But like but like the smile on his face, like the hairstyle he got, like in the cartoons. How the mask gonna go around and see through on the back. Got a little style on the back. The detail of the cape on the round flowing. But he looks nice, but he got a lot of issues in his uh, uh, articulation. And speaking of that, that's what we go with now. With the million, can't really get his head far too back because the hair kind of blocking head head going back so basically it looks straight you got a lot of tilt that side look down but you can't really look back arms you go up that high box of swivel double elbows we're good range there bring hands and wrist but mine's a little stiff but it's, it's all on that little joint so you know we're falling use these type of joints how to, I need to heat these up I ain't get a chance to. But like I said, one of the QC issues they I don't I do not like is the abs. Abs, you got this type of the style that you used on the uh, Batman and the Superman in the, the first wave you actually done. Why you why you went back to this? I don't know because he does not have no ab crunch going forward. Barely a little bit goes back a lot because I know. I'm, Cartoon always goes back a lot. That looks tight, got a little bit there, but going forward, nothing at all. He got he supposed to have an extra piece down here. They're supposed to help that, but yeah, when he gets how his main part of the belt right here, it blocks it too, and so was this. So he does that has no articulation and his waves going forward in the ab crunch. So but he does do the splits by that much. Can barely kick 
forward. You gotta really push it. Go forward. Go back. Not as much. Get the elbow knees. As you can see, if you go back that much, if you go forward that much, he does have a toe hinge there. So, with his legs and his abs, yeah, I'm gonna have to see how much I'm gonna take issue with these, but trust me, I think I can be able to. Maybe pull it off some of his moves. But yeah, but with that, I might see if I can go pop off the top and try to try to uh, make the the gap that's on the inside to be able to be, be able to kind of like bend more. So I'm gonna try that there. And now we come part of the video. You see how see how other figures in the line. That looks next to uh, uh, Mario. All the same height, even though he's a teenager. <laughs> He hit like, he hit like, uh, who, who kind of hard, could he tall <laughs> as a dog, as a dog feature, so, so, that's how he looks with him right there. And up next, this is like, he stacks up next to McFarlane Toys, My Hair Girl, Damien, Gravity, aka Chaco. like the height difference between the two here, because she is kind of small. And he does fit the same height style that it is right there. So I do like them like like uh by each other. And last but not least, is I stacks of the the, the Minecraft baby is uh the second version of uh of a Adoria, aka Deku in his I think he his gamma costume, same costume, but the sleeves are more longer, and he has like, uh, he has like ankle brace and a, and a, and a, and a, and a, and a uh, what's name, on his knees, so, I like these two together, I can't wait to take some pictures, now, the figure that we need next, since, same time we got him and Ida, and we got Spain. So now we got these two. We need an overhaul. So I don't, I got a feeling if he does do overhaul, he's gonna do the one of him as an actual monster, as a regular release, and then the plain, the plain version as the as the uh, Atom Edition. That's my theory like, that he might go in. I hope not. So hopefully he's gonna make just one in, in like one wave and other wave or something else. Or I don't know, but I got a feeling. I got a feeling he, he's gonna have the monster as the as the actual <laughs> actual platinum edition and the plain one as the uh, as regular. What I would say to do have the plain overhaul. As a regular release, but have the monster overhaul as a deluxe packaging. So one will be 19, and the other one will be, will be 40 bucks. I buy them both, so you know we're going to go in, put them out as that because it's easy to find. Having stores or online, and I can just buy both instead of me trying to hunt down. The the uh, the other versions of like him is like it's crazy. Yeah, but uh, that's my rant for like for like all these uh at the series that he has out now. Certain ones you gotta sit there trying to hunt down and find and nah. Like like a home chicken off that news. I ain't got time for that. <laughs> so just give it to me now. Give me my toys. I want them. I'll be done. Ran over. <laughs>
and this is my review of McFallen Toys My Hero Academia um, Miro Togata aka Love Million hope y'all enjoyed this review trust me boy had a fun time making it you know every review I will take pictures this is my Instagram right here but I will leave links down below we're going to check those out and you boys on TikTok while well, I take those same pictures post over there while I just add a little bit of flair this is your boy CB Hunts. Hope you have a blessed one. And trust me, I can catch you in that next one.